the blonde woman asked as she woke up in a dark muddy cave. She asked as she looked around her surroundings while hearing voices in her head. Chapter 1 
The blonde woman stops for a minute, lost in thought. As the dank, muddy caves arouse you, starts getting nauseating. The blonde woman thought back to quote, her partner. He probably was lost. Like her. She took a quick glance around the room she entered. Water seemed to be dripping from the ceiling. She quickly realized she was going crazy, her mind drifted of thoughts and fears.
made a mistake. I made a mistake while writing this. You weren't supposed to be the protagonist. I don't know where's quote, okay. But I'm sure I can help you find him. I assume so. I would like to, but it wouldn't make sense. Would it? Shouldn't you fall on him in a place that gives enough context to come to conclusion? Chapter 2 that? Oh, crap. I gave you the wrong gun. You're not supposed to fly over everything, like that. Jeez, I screwed up even worse this time. Pretty please, can you throw it away or something? Sorry about this. For some unexplainable reason, the gun tragically crumbled into dust. But, to her great pleasure, because it fits the area. Kinda, also, it can't fly. However, it appeared that the golden-haired maiden could not progress further. The flaxen-haired lass, willingly, took the other path.
Here, take it.
Good. Time for a boss fight. This guy is a enemy. You got to beat him up. Crap. Ah. Uh.
Kingdom. Wait really? You do realize you're leaving him to die? But how would you be sure that you'll see him again? There's no certainty you would.
Are you okay? Oh good. No because I noticed I made the flow of the water a bit too strong, back there. A very tragic turn of events happened here. Leaving behind the gas leaking, ah, uh, rotting bodies of the fallen. Yeah, they do. But I have to give some exposition. Okay. Yeah, you do have a point. It's just enough.
Yeah well, enemies did drop a chest too in the original cave story.
Thank you. 
to be continued. Curly's Weird Crusade. Chapter 3.